The Titan Arm is a powered upper body exoskeleton, and it's really got two use cases that we built it for, both occupational lifting as well as physical therapy. Occupational lifting is any sort of job where you need to repeatedly lift a heavy load. And the problem is that people get tired doing this and then they suffer from fatigue and that results in bad lifting form which leads to injury. The Titan suit augments a normal user's strength by 40 pounds. The Titan arm can also help rehabilitate someone after suffering from an upper body injury. sensors that can track the user's range of motion when they're wearing the arm. A patient can upload this data to their doctor um, so that they can see you know, how much they're improving in their range of motion over time. Really early on, we started prototyping. We spent over 300 hours in the machine shop creating parts and components. That was actually all of our spring break was spent machining. With all the funds we've got from the James Dyson Award, I think we're going to be investing heavily in research in the future, electromyography, other sorts of sensing and inputs, and uh, different sorts of manufacturing techniques. Students coming in to our programs thirsting for opportunities to do innovative things, giving them an outlet, something to keep them going at three in the morning when life is crazy and things aren't working, that there's some kind of like higher goal that they're going after, that resonates. The superhero that can benefit most from Titan Arm is definitely Batman. Since we won the James Dyson Award, we can make a second Titan Arm for Robin. I think the superhero who could most use the suit would be Bruce Banner, because when he's all hulked up, he's used to so much strength, but when he comes back to mild-mannered Bruce Banner, he needs a little extra lifting capacity for what he's used to. Also, I know that the Hulk has a lot of back strain issues and the Titan Arm would help him with that as well.